Hello 105, my name is Brittany Teacher and today is Monday, March 30th, 2020. Today we are going to do your Storytown Workbook, page 36. Today you need to write a paragraph about a topic. Today's topic is, I learned how to. We are going to use the story about Gus and his new bike, Gus and Grandpa. Gus learned to ride a bike in the story we read. Gus learned how to ride a bike in the story we read and he tried many times to learn how to do something new but it was very hard for him. So he fell and he tried again. And then he went to his grandpa's house and his grandpa helped him and he kept trying. And then he eventually learned how to ride a bike. Okay, Gus and grandpa and the two wheel bike. So now I want you to write a story about something you learned to do. It can be anything. You learned how to read English. You learned how to draw a kind of picture. You learned how to cook something. You learned how to make something. You learned how to play piano. It doesn't matter. You learned how to swim, okay? I used an example on the board. I learned how to roller skate. You see in the middle? This is what you are going to do at the top of your page, okay? Your topic, I learned how to blah, 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 okay? And in the middle, you're going to write the activity, right? So right here, I'm going to write roller skate. Just like this. I learned how to roller skate. And in the middle, roller skate. Then you are going to make five circles. One, two, three, four, five. Just like this just like I did on the board, okay? And you are going to write about the process of learning how to do something. First, you don't know how, and all of your friends can do it. Second, you try to learn by yourself, and it's too hard. Maybe you fall down, maybe you get hurt, maybe you can't do it. Third, you ask for help from mom or dad, grandma or grandpa. Fourth, you practice many times. And then fifth, now you are good at this thing. Now you can roller skate or swim or whatever. Okay, that's what I did. In the first circle, I wrote, friends could do it. I fell many times. I practiced with my mom. I tried over and over. Now I can skate. Okay, you need to write something like that for whatever you are learning to do. Then you need to write five sentences in your paragraph about learning how to do this. Whatever you choose. Use, uh, use words like first, next, later, then, and after, or la last. Okay, use as much detail as you can. Tell me about colors. Tell me about feelings. Tell me about how hard it was, or how easy it was, or how much fun you had. Tell me about your friends, if you learned how to do something with your friend. Tell me their names, right? Tell me every detail you can think. For example, I learned how to roller skate when I was 10. Tell me how old you are learning, or how old you are when you're learning something. I learned how to roller skate with my mom and my little sister. I learned how to roller skate after school. My skates were purple and black. It was really hard. I fell and hurt my knee and I cried a little bit. But then my mom said, you can do it. And she held my hand and she practiced. And we did it over and over again. And then I got better at roller skating and now I can roller skate with my friends. 
and it makes me feel very happy, okay? So try to write like that. Tell me names, tell me feelings, tell me colors, tell me everything you can. Use first, second, last, finally, okay? Remember to write slowly, focus on your handwriting, because when you take a picture, it's very difficult for me to read it, okay? So you have to write very well, write neatly, okay? Because if you don't write neatly, I will say write one more time. And I don't want you to make a same mistake again, okay? So just write one time, very slowly and very well, okay? Thank you for watching and I will see you next time. I look forward to reading your paragraphs. Have a good day. Bye.